This is a video showing peer proportional navigation to waypoint follow. Here the user can enter the desired waypoints and it will execute. In this case, the vehicle is traveling with 25 meters per second constant velocity, has an initial heading of 30 degrees, and is a navigation constant of 4. It's going to run the simulation for five different times for each uh, waypoint and then it compiles the data into one large set and here we have the position as a function of time being plotted out you can see that the missile acceleration approaches zero each time it approaches one of the waypoints it's going to head back to waypoint three Likewise, each one goes to zero for the distance as the waypoint approaches it. It's going to come back and finish at where it started. Likewise, on VR and V theta, each one starts and approaches for VR. It approaches some negative constant value at the same time that V theta approaches zero. Here we can see it plotted out as a function of time. Again, as it's coming around this leg, it's going to be a negative V theta value, and then it's going to jump to a positive VR value here momentarily as it approaches this segment right here. So now it is on this leg. as it rounds and it approaches and now it's going to come over and it's going to have a uh, positive V theta apparently this simulation is slowing down there we go and it is a positive V theta as it comes back to zero this would be approaching this waypoint right here And likewise, it makes another pass as it approaches the last waypoint. And it comes back to zero again. That is pure proportional navigation with user input of multi-waypoint variables. Thank you.